I call the Honourable To Henare. You know, um, there's something else that hasn't been used for the last 30 years either, Mr Graham. Um, and and I, I suppose that member should be on the stage, preferably the next one out of town. Mr, Mr. Speaker, Mr. Speaker, the serious side of this, this issue, the serious side of this issue is, the thi is things like Raglan, is things like taking a, a, a pub private property for the use of military purposes, which is exactly what Raglan was. And if you have it on the statutes, it could happen again. If you have it on the statutes, there is every likelihood. It could be. Oh, look, he says, the, 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 the member says, come on. Well, let's go back to when, when this piece of legislation was promulgated. 1915. At the end of 1918, people said to each other, we'll never do this again. Never do this again. But in a few short years, there was another world war. Mr. Oh, see, this is, that's, the sort of, that's the sort of objection I would expect from an appeaser, from a, from a person who is, not, not, is, who is an appeaser. That's all he is. It won't happen to us. And that's what Kennedy Graham is saying. This will never be used again. The fact of the matter is that it's still, it is still on our statute books. And so why wouldn't we get rid of it? Why wouldn't we get rid of it? And as the Honourable Marion Street says, we could have done it umpteen dozen ways, but democracy says that we're allowed to do it this way. So who says, who says that we are wrong in doing it this way? They're going to vote for our bill. They're going to vote for uh, Bakshi's bill. The fact order, of the matter is... Order. Yes. <laughs> The member knows he's been here long enough that you refer to the person by their full name or their title. Oh. Can't try. Okay. Respect. <laughs> the fact of the matter is that it's still on our books, and every law that is still on our books means that you can use those provisions in any of the laws. It's quite simple. So Mr Singh, in his, in his wisdom, thought, well, why not let... Why not use the, the member's bill process to get rid of a pretty draconian piece of legislation, I might add. A, a, pretty, a pretty draconian piece of legislation. And so if we can't use the process that the standing orders and, uh, that are given us, then there's something wrong with this place. And all he is doing is using the process of Parliament to get rid of a draconian piece of legislation. And I salute my friend for doing that, getting rid of a draconian piece of legislation. Excellent. Here, here, great speech. Oh, no, they're queuing up. Yeah, they're queuing up now. Um, point, of order, point of order. Point of order, the Honourable Tohanari. Mr Speaker, is it not correct that when you want the call, you're supposed to call? Yes, it is, Mr Nari. And it's, it's the New Zealand First opportunity, and the member should actually call, otherwise he does not get called and loses it. Mr Speaker, I apologise. I uh, no. was looking at the speaking order and uh, being... No, no, the no, member must call first, Mr Speaker. Mr Speaker. I call the Honourable Richard...